You guys will not believe what I found at Zara. So I'm back with a, another Zara haul. I couldn't resist myself and I had to check out what was new at Zara for fall and I know I feel like I just posted a Zara haul. But then TikTok got me you guys. My For You page was literally all of Zara hauls, Zara hauls, Zara hauls and so many cute things kept popping up on my feed and I just, I couldn't anymore. I tried to fight the temptation but I just couldn't and so I went to the mall and what did I do? I went shopping and I got some really cute Zara stuff for fall. So without further ado, let's just get right into the haul. Okay, so we are starting off with this sweater. This fall, I'm all about the oversized knit sweaters. I have tons of like little cropped ones and I was like, you know what? This time around, I'm gonna invest in some good oversized sweaters. So I got this one. I thought this one was really cute. It's so cozy. And you can really make this sweater look really cute if you style it. But I also just love lounging in it. But I'm gonna show you guys a quick little easy way that you can style this outfit if you're like going out for like an errand run with leggings. So in case you guys are wondering, this is a size small. So this is how a small fits on me. And I really love the back. I love how this flaps over. I think that's a really nice touch. So that being said, I'm gonna show you guys how this vest looks with this sweater. I wore this the other day to go to the dentist. And it was like a really cute, comfortable outfit to just go out to do some like errands. I think that a look like this is really cute. Just for like a casual day out. This is how it looks in the back. I decided to put the little flap on the sweater over the over the vest. I feel like that just looked cuter. Be cute for just like a casual day out. Again, I wore this to the dentist and I felt really comfortable. I felt really cute in it. It's really cozy, very warm, which we love. I like these little jawstrings, so you could just you can tug on them if you want more a but like a fitted look here at the bottom. Um, I like it as is, but it's nice that it has that option. But this vest has pockets, so that's really nice to you keep your hands warm or just like store things in there. You know, use what pockets are for. So next, I have this beige knit sweater. I really love the fact that it has a high cowl neck. It covers the butt area, so again, it's pretty oversized. I got this one in a size. Hold on. This is a medium large. I thought it was this very pretty neutral beige because I love wearing neutrals in general, but especially in the fall time. And I feel like they just get more wear because they can go with a lot of different things that you might just already have in your closet. I feel like it's a good idea to spend it on sweaters that you're not just gonna get bored of, but ones that are that are timeless and that you feel like you're gonna be able to recycle many times in your closet. So I have a skirt. Right now, these mini skirts are all the rage and Zara came out with some really cute pleated mini skirts for the fall. So I got this like plaid brown one, a little pleated and it's actually a skirt. And I thought that together this will look really cute, so we're gonna put her on. So this is what the skirt looks like. I love it. I have been a huge fan of Tulis for my literally my entire life. All my little girl dreams are coming true right now because pleated plaid skirts are back and also loafers are back and that just screams clueless to me and the style of that movie was just like just like none other i really love the skirt it's really cute i got mine in a size small this is what the back looks like this is the front very cute so i actually have a pair of loafers here they're not from zara the ones i have are from steve madden but i know zara also carries loafers i already had a pair so i didn't need to buy any but i'll link them below if you are looking for loafers very cute and scholarly, and I think it's such a cute fall outfit, but I think we can make it better. This jacket, literally iconic. I am in love with it. Just like, take a look at this jacket. I got mine in a size medium. I tried on the small. Small also fit well, but I figured that if I'm going to be wearing it with like chunky knits underneath, I feel like a medium will just fit better. So I'll put her on to show you guys. How cute is this jacket. So I got the tag attached. I haven't worn it out yet, but I think this jacket is just like really giving a moment. I do not want to take off this outfit. It is just too cute for words. Okay, so next up I have none other than another sweater. And it is this very soft, sort of like a fleece material v-neck sweater. So we are going to put her on. 
So, as you can see, this sweater also looks really cute with this skirt. I got the sweater in a size medium. So just for funsies, I'm gonna try on the jacket on again to see how it looks like with this sweater. I just like draped the jacket over a little bit over my shoulder like that, I feel like. That adds a cute touch to it, and then I tucked the sweater into my bra bit to give it a little bit of a cropped look. That's what I also loved about buying sweaters that are already oversized. You can manipulate them to look like cropped sweaters by just tucking them in, whereas if you buy a cropped sweater, you can't make them look bigger. So at least you get the variety of this with an oversized. Um, and again, it's a great way to like make an outfit look a bit different, even though maybe you're wearing the exact same sweater. <laughs> Confused. Confused. Zoe came to join. She loves to be part of the Zara hauls. Look at her outfit. Zoe, show the people your outfit. She is a stylish queen. Look, she even has a matching bow. Guys, dress brought to you by Amazon. So this is one way you could style this sweater. I changed out my skirt for this one that I just had in my closet. And then I have this purse that I got from Zara last year. And then again, my loafers. If you have like a white headband and you're all about wearing headbands, I think that will look really cute. I don't have one, but if I did, I'd probably throw one on. I think it's really like fun, cutesy, girly, preppy kind of look and I'm all about it. So next is this other mini pleated skirt that I got from Zara. This one is also a skirt, but it's not like the other one where it's like you see shorts at the back. It's just like a skirt all the way through and then it has like shorts underneath. So this is what the gray skirt looks like on. I love it. I think it's really, really cute. The skirt, is it not giving Britney Spears vibe? Baby hit me one more time. I swear she was wearing a gray pleated skirt like this with like her white button up and her little gray cardi. So I decided to keep this shirt on because I have an outfit in mind that I think would really look cute with this. So I'm gonna do like a little half in, half out tuck. Going back in with loafer. And I have this sweater here that we have not yet talked about. And it is the classic striped sweater. Now I'm not exactly sure if this is one that's been trending on TikTok that I've seen all over the place and we love it. So I had to get my hands on it. Are you gonna tell me that this is not the cutest outfit you have ever seen? Because I think this is the cutest outfit I have ever put on. And I'm going back in with my bag. Okay, so I think it's only right if I show you guys what this sweater looks like on because obviously we're not gonna be just wearing it draped over our shoulders all the time. This is the sweater on. I think she's so cute. Looks really good with the skirt as well. Very chic and classic. And it sort of gives that vibe of like looking expensive on a budget. So I got this in a size extra large. As you can see, the sleeves are pretty long, but I love it that way. I have one more thing on the haul but it's okay because we're gonna go out with a bang. Look at her. Wow. Wowzers. I absolutely love. Need to say more? Just look. Okay. Try her on with the skirt because I think it could be a really cute, sleek, edgy moment. So let me change my shirt. Let me change it to the sweater and put on a different shirt that I think will look cute with this jacket. So here's what the jacket looks like on. I put it on with just like this little bodysuit tank that I got from Zara. I figured that with some glasses, it would look really nice together. And then I changed out my socks to some black ones to wear with my loafers. It is giving. Edgy meets girly meets preppy. So I always gotta throw on a classic black, all black look. Well, I mean, we have a little bit of gray, but, but you get the vibe. She's a dark moody girl with a little bit of edge. So we made it to the end of the haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm gonna leave everything linked in the description box so you guys can click on the little links if you wanna shop any of these pieces. If you guys like this style of video, I personally have enjoyed filming this type of haul more where I can like show you guys how you style the pieces and just talk through it. I think it's just a lot more fun and it's just like more of a chill way of doing hauls in general. So let me know if you guys like it. And if you do, just give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. We are at 10.8 thousand followers so 2800 i am so grateful to each and every one of you for tuning in for subscribing for joining the family so thank you guys all so much and thank you all to the returning subscribers as well that tune into every video love you guys all and i'll see you in my next video Mwah. bye guys